matter of fact, I just got robbed last week. Be careful. Oh. Be careful. <clears throat> Took somebody home. She drugged them. What's up guys, it's your boy Virtual Minister and we back with another video. Hope y'all having a wonderful day. And in today's video, I'm going to be talking about a story that a guy told me last night while I was out on the streets in CTG. You know, I met this guy, you know, he's American, but he traveled to the, he traveled a lot. So he been, he said he'd been coming to CTG for probably two years and he recently got drugged last week from the scopamine drug sorry if i'm pronouncing it wrong forgive me but the scopamine drug that's been becoming very popular in medellin and other places in colombia i ain't really heard much stories about it in ctg but you know it's in ctg so you got to be careful in ctg the girls you know some girls might have access to it and it's a very dangerous drug if you don't know do your research but let's talk about his situation and what happened. I also got some clips of him talking about it a little bit. You know, he, he said he wants to stay anonymous, you know. So, yeah, I can't even interview him or anything like that. I just got a little recording from us talking last night and such and such. But I'm going to play a little bit of it so y'all could hear what he was saying. Be careful. <clears throat> Took somebody home. Be careful. Oh, oh, she put it in your drink? I have no idea. So you got knocked out? Knocked out. I was out. And she took my laptop, my cell phones, she took my watch. You didn't give us email again. I'm looking. I'm looking. That's crazy. I thought that only happened in many I, I never heard of that happening here. So I really wasn't like on guard, but it happened to me. So be careful. I, 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 I really gotta explain no more about this drug they call this scopamine, right? I gotta, I wanna, I wanna ask some people about it. Maybe. Yes. How to prevent it and stuff like that, you know? Because I don't know. Crazy. Because the thing is, I, I remember. The thing is, when I left here, I left here alone. Usually, I take somebody with me. Yeah. But I left, I left here alone. I got, when I got some numbers. And the one that I got a number from, I got home. I didn't have service on my phone, but when I got home, my Wi Fi kept gone. And I, all these deleted messages came on my phone. I don't see it. And I'm looking, I'm looking, I'm looking, and one, she sent me some pictures with some porno and everything like that. She was like, I want to come over. I need some money. I'm like, look, I ain't got no money. I said, you wanna come over? I'll pay you next time I see you. She said, okay. That was my mistake. Never knew a girl, didn't know her. I never take anybody home that I don't know. She came to my place. All I remember, all I remember <laughs> is, she's like, here, do you got any beer? I got 12 beers out of the refrigerator. She had one, I had one. I'm drinking, she's drinking, come pie. Oh, I'm sorry, sorry. Uh, cheers or whatever, saloon. And I sat down, I went over to uh, turn the music on, came back. She must have put it in my drink when I turned my I did. For what? Yeah, I mean, I, I was, we were, we were there for maybe 10 minutes. 10 minutes. After that, I woke up 2 o'clock in the afternoon. I looked up, what? I looked, my laptop was gone, my shit was gone, she would throw off my shit. She didn't touch me, thank God. Because it could have been a lot worse. You know? Okay, that's a story, man. You should... So I was here for one week, and it happened the day before New Year's Eve. I couldn't call my family. She had New Year's. I couldn't get any money sent to me. All I had was the food that I had inside my apartment. So for like six days, I was like on the desert island by myself. Because nobody speaks English. You know, I can't. How you got on that situation? Huh? How you got on the situation? Like, how you, how you got stuff going again? Oh, uh, my stuff is still gone. Oh, okay. My, my, the landlord, uh, he was pissed that it happened on his property. Because usually. Yeah, so guys, as you can hear from that audio, 
you know it's a little messed up but you can still understand i got the captions there i put the captions so y'all could you know understand what was being said so he got jogged in ctg last week she went with his laptop and his two phones you know and it's so crazy that you know he been coming here so long and you know it still happens so just shows you that it can happen to anyone you know just be careful when you're out here y'all just be careful with random girls people you don't know you gotta be careful you gotta be extra careful this is not the dominican republic colombia is way different but um yeah so you know i'm so glad that he's good though you know he he, he lost his phone the, the girl went with the laptop and thank thankful thank god he's alive you know because it could have go it could have been a lot of worse he could have died you know a lot of people have been dying from this drug because the girls be mixing it and it'd be too strong so they be overdosing people so thank god you know thank god he's alive but um yeah guys this is just a video to bring awareness to the situation and stuff that's happening in this country with this drug called scopamine or whatever it is i'm gonna have to find i'm gonna you know what i'm gonna do i'm gonna i'm gonna, I'm gonna go out there in color I'm gonna look for someone that has access to it and I really want to get some info on this drug and I, I just want to find out like how to prevent it well we all know how to prevent it you got to be smart you can't just have what he did wrong is he was drinking with the girl and he left his drink and we all know you can't do that me I'm not even drinking from anyone here I ain't eating from anyone here in such and such but we all know what to do to prevent it but I want to know like why is it so like I want to know how it's made but I know it's a synthetic drug. I ain't know. But I just really want to know more about it. You know, I'm very curious. So if I could find somebody in this community that has and I could I could get some information from, that would be some nice content for y'all. If y'all want me to do that, let me know in the comment section. But yeah, that's it for today's video. If y'all enjoyed this video, make sure you leave a like, make sure you leave a comment. And if you came this far and you haven't liked the video, I'm disappointed in you, bro. Thanks for watching the video. I'm out.